the Freightliner SmartPlex electrical system. SmartPlex is the name given to the multiplex electrical system expansion that is offered on the Freightliner Business Class M2, the 114SD and 108SD vocational trucks. Multiplexing is the ability to send multiple electronic messages through the same signal path at the same time and then recover as separate signals on the receiving end. The goal is to share an expensive resource, simplify the connection inputs and outputs, and overall reduce the cost of body upfitting and total life cycle maintenance costs on the truck. These videos are designed to introduce the Freightliner SmartPlex system and explain how it works. By the end of this series, you should have a good understanding of the advantages of a multiplex system and why the Freightliner SmartPlex expansion system makes it the best on the market today. What is multiplexing? Multiplexing has a direct positive impact on a truck equipment manufacturer's ability to install components on a chassis platform since it can reduce the amount of wiring required, simplify connections, and streamline body control functionality. However, it is one of the least understood aspects of the body-to-chassis connection. A good example of multiplexing is to think of a typical highway infrastructure. In this example, we have three cities and nine towns. Between the cities, there are multi-lane highways for many cars to travel. In between the cities and towns, there are rural two-lane roads. On the roads in between each town and city, there is only a single lane for cars to travel. Now let's apply this to the multiplex electrical system. We replace the cities with control modules, replace the towns with switches and body functions, and replace the roads with wires. The cars are replaced with packets of data or signals. This represents our electrical system. The multi-lane highways are referred to as the J1939 twisted pair. The twisted pair of wires is yellow and green in color and often referred to as the J1939 backbone. The control modules are small computers that process information for their specific commodity. The engine has a computer, the transmission has a computer, and the truck has a computer. The engine computer is the engine control module, or ECM. The transmission computer is the transmission control unit, or TCU. And the computer on the truck is the bulkhead module, or BHM. The engine control module, transmission control unit, bulkhead module, chassis module, and instrument cluster all communicate together to coordinate truck functions, much like multiple computers talk to each other over a shared network. All of these computers send information to each other relative to their commodity. Examples of this for the engine would be engine RPM, engine oil temperature, and coolant temperature. These messages are broadcast over the network and the computers to make decisions based on that information. For example, if the coolant temperature is above 270 degrees, the bulkhead module would read that information and send a message to the instrument cluster to turn on a light. Why use multiplexing? Multiplexing creates four key advantages for an electrical system. These include reduced wiring, increased flexibility, accessible programmability, and ease of integration for truck equipment manufacturers. Multiplexing reduces wiring. As in the previous example of the coolant temperature, the wiring doesn't have to be directly tied to a component. There isn't a single wire directly linking the engine thermostat and the light in the instrument cluster. Instead, information broadcast over the network sends a signal based on a programmed parameter. Additionally, the wiring between the computers is a single twisted pair, rather than a bundle. Not only does this reduce cost, it also reduces the chances of failures due to corrosion or cut wires. Multiplexing is flexible. Also shown in the coolant temperature example, 
If we want a light to come on at 300 degrees instead of 270, we can do this with a simple number change in the programming. Without multiplexing, we would physically have to change out the thermostat. Additionally, interlocks can be added so that certain functions do not operate unless other predefined functions are activated. Examples include a park brake interlock, a transmission neutral interlock, or vehicle speed interlock. Multiplexing is programmable. The truck can function based on messages from other computers. This can happen by loading a parameter from Freightliner's service link, which is custom software that will program functions without additional wiring or relays. Functions can be turned on or off or changed by merely programming the truck's electrical system using service link. For example, the customer may want the headlights to turn on if the windshield wipers are activated. Or if the park brake is set and a switch is activated, then the work light comes on. Additionally, if the park brake is not set and a door is open, then the horn will sound. Multiplexing offers ease of integration. By allowing the customer access to multiplex switches, they can add a body computer module that will receive messages from all of the controllers to perform body functions over the J1939 network. This reduces wiring between the chassis and the body, the body and the transmission, and the body and the engine. To demonstrate the benefits of multiplexing and the flexibility and ease of integration it offers, let's take a look at the difference between a hardwired and multiplex truck. In a traditional electrical system, high current switches are hardwired. That means the current to operate a piece of equipment flows directly through the switch. This requires separate harnessing and pinouts to the switches. These switches are typically connected to the truck battery through a power distribution module that uses fuses and relays. A multiplex system uses low current smart switches that communicate with the primary chassis control module through the J1939 data bus. The bulkhead module is the brain of the system and communicates with the chassis module based on the feature information associated with the smart switch. In a hardwired circuit, if we wanted to make a change to the electrical system to improve functionality, the wiring would have to be spliced. Splicing is not recommended because it creates opportunities for shorts and corrosion. In addition, splicing wiring to make a circuit change can take several hours or longer depending on the change. In a multiplex system, the wiring is already in place and all we have to do is change the programming parameters. A parameter can be changed in only a few minutes. Unlike hardwired switches that are fixed and connected to relays, smart switches can be relocated without requiring a programming or parameter change. If a switch function change is needed, SmartPlex allows for changing the functionality of features through reprogramming of the control module. Adding additional functionality, for example a park brake interlock, requires more wiring and relays in a traditional hardwired system. In a multiplex system, many interlocks such as park brake, neutral and others are already inputted into the bulkhead module and the system only requires a change to the parameters to incorporate the desired interlocks into the feature.